and welcome to Lifestyle with Chinese Versatile. How have you been? How are you doing? And I'm sure that this meets you well. If you're seeing this, then I am most certain that you have made it to the 31st day of December 2020. And as I speak with you right now, it's about 6.30 in the morning and yeah, in this part of my world. Ah, uh, well, it's been so good. I mean, 2020 has really been an impactful year for us. And um, only God knows the end from the beginning and he's given us this rare privilege to be alive of which I am so 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 thankful in 2020 there were lots of deaths that were recorded we've had um, majorly from the pandemic uh, coronavirus COVID-19 as you might know it as Rona as I know as I like to call it but this year overall has really um, impacted people both positively and negatively while i would like to dwell on the positives of the year 2020 i want to also acknowledge that i know that there are lots of people who have had to lose a loved one a friend a family member to the virus and i would like to say to you if ever you were affected by this my heart goes out to you and i pray that god grants you the fortitude to bear the loss amen so try and cheer up and leave more in the memories of your loved one okay the good memories that you had shared together in your time i mean during the time on earth here yeah. all right so that being said i actually wanted to record also of how wonderful you know does i have been trying my best to focus on the positives in this month and it has really paid off to be honest with you i have lived a happier calmer um, less anxious life trying to uh, operate on a positive um, vibes throughout the month and i'm glad i've come to the end of that challenge and i'm so grateful for the outcome well that being said um i'd like to account that 2020 this year was the year i actually also started on my youtube journey and i'm like seven months into this journey and super grateful for the outcome because it's been like a long time coming for me so I'm so happy that I eventually took off on this journey and here I am. I'm actually praying that by the end of, um, I'm actually praying that by the end of this year, I mean before it's 12 midnight, I make it to 500 subscribers. I can't wait. And that way I know that I'm like halfway into my YouTube um, target, okay? But I'm not really like crazy keen on it because I am doing what I love. I love to share, you know, ideas i love to share knowledge that i might know i love to entertain so i'm hoping that so far if you've been following me for a long time now i want to hope that so far you have been entertained you have learned a new thing or two and um, probably you just had fun i know it's not really funny and all of that but thank you for joining me in the course of my life i want to also say to you if you've watched this video to this point just go ahead and subscribe if you're not yet subscribed to this channel and also hit the notification bell so you get information when the new content drops all right um yeah i am going to read from the scriptures right now because i really don't want to make this a very long video but if you do not know or if you might have guessed right or wrong i'm still going to clear you out on it i am a christian a bible believing christian a christ loving christian and um my heart beats for the lord in service and ministry so i would like to read from the scriptures Precisely from the book of Psalms chapter 136, um, from verse 1 to the end. This is a scripture my dad really likes to read um, every Thanksgiving period. And I really love the scripture because it just encourages us. So without further ado, if you've got your Bible, pick it up. And if you've got Bible on your phone, open up to it. We can read it together. Um, usually dad would say, read, um, read the other line while he reads the other line. But whatever the case may be, I'll be reading it. And I'm reading from the Revised Standard Version of this Bible. Okay, and um, I've got my drink here with me. Yeah, that's my ginger drink. I've been taking for a while now. I think sometimes I've spent money in these videos. Um, in the course of this channel, I'll share with you my morning routine drink. Probably if you try it, it helps keep stop me. I'm not a coffee person, so that's why I do some of these drinks. And the fact that it is rich in vitamin C, mostly not tips it up for me honestly and you know i've just recovered from the rona so i need to build up on my um, vitamin c's and my immune system okay so let's um 
go right ahead to the scriptures. Psalm chapter 136, verse 1 to the end reads, I'll give thanks to the Lord for he is good, for his steadfast love endures forever. I'll give thanks to the God of gods, for his steadfast love endures forever. I'll give thanks to the Lord of hosts, for his mercies, for his steadfast love endures forever. To him who alone deserves great wonders, for his steadfast love endures forever. To him who by understanding made the heavens, for his steadfast love endures forever. To him who spread out the earth upon the waters, for his steadfast love endures forever. To him who made the great lights, for his steadfast love endures forever. The sun to rule over the day, for his steadfast love endures forever. The moon and night to rule over the night, for his steadfast love endures forever. To him who smote the firstborn of Egypt, for his steadfast love endures forever. And brought Israel out from among them, for his steadfast love endures forever. With a strong hand and an outstretched arm, for his steadfast love endures forever. To him who divided the Red Sea in Sunder, for his steadfast love endures forever. And made Israel pass through the midst of it, for his steadfast love endures forever. But overthrew Pharaoh and his host into the Red Sea, for his steadfast love endures forever. To him who led his people through the wilderness, for his steadfast love endures forever. Um, to him who smote great kings in his to him who smote great kings for his steadfast love endures forever, and slew famous kings for his steadfast love endures forever. Sihon, king of Amorites, for his steadfast love endures forever. White um and Og, king of Bashan, for his steadfast love endures forever, and gave their land as a heritage, for his steadfast love endures forever, a heritage to Israel his servant, for his steadfast love endures forever forever. It is he who remembered us in our low estate, for his steadfast love endures forever, and rescued us from our foes, for his steadfast love endures forever. He who gives food to all flesh, for his steadfast love endures forever. Oh, give thanks to the God of heaven, for his steadfast love endures forever. Amen. Thank you, Lord, for the reading of your word. We pray that we will have every cause and every reason to always worship you. In Jesus' name, amen. Okay, so this is from the scripture. It's been good looking into the word of God. And I am going to trust that you have a great day and uh, also pray that you have a happy day, even as we gradually usher ourselves into the year 2021. I'm super excited for what 2021 holds. And don't worry, um, there will be a lot of organization as regards this channel. So just stay tuned for more updates, okay? So for now, I think I have talked enough and I have to stop here right now. I'll see you in the next video and see you on the 1st of January 2020. Hopefully and God willing, we will see and break boundaries together. For now, it is love and light. Namaste and peace be with you. See you on the next video.